How's it? IndianCowboy.Sports.com coming at you here on a Tuesday, September the 7th, as we get this video to you every day around this time. Have your free pick winner in just a second today. Today, your free pick is going to be between the Toronto Blue Jays and uh, the New York Yankees in just a second. We'll also talk to you about Philadelphia and Milwaukee in baseball. Uh, YouTube Premium is going to be between the Reds and Cubs and uh, Connecticut and Dallas in the WNBA today. Uh, what do I need to tell you here today? Um, we missed our free pick play yesterday as uh, Ole Miss got it done over Louisville. Louisville wasn't able to hang tough. So 6-1 and 12-4, and 182-144, 334, 253, 14-14, and 10-57 free pick run. Hopefully we'll get you a free pick winner today. We'll see what happens. And um, yeah, as far as YouTube Premium, we won yesterday again. We were on a 3-0, 7-2, and 24-15. And uh, 32 and 19, so uh, over 60% for two months now on YouTube Premium. We gave you the, the Twins yesterday. They got it done 5-2 to two on Monday. Sunday, we gave you the Padres, and uh, which was a winner. We gave you Atlanta Dream outright as a lean as well. Saturday, we gave you Texas State over Baylor for a winner there on YouTube Premium. Hello, I am Indian Cowboy. This is Doc Sports. Doc Sports has been around for 50 years, and Indian Cowboy has been around for 15 years with Doc Sports and 17 years overall. And um, how it works is our best selections are over at DocSports.com. Our next best selections are at YouTube Premium and uh, on our YouTube Premium channel, which the link is below. And then we give you free picks and leans here every day. The YouTube Premium channel has an extra video every day, has about 60 to 100 free picks per month. And you get to do hang out on a live show with me every Thursday night as uh, we get to talk about 7 to 10 extra games for free, uh, free picks there. And then anything else you want to talk about, algorithms, uh, letdowns, bounce, bounce back theories, models, etc. So, um, yeah, yesterday we had a good day. We won the, in baseball yesterday on the Houston Astros run line, minus the 1.5 at uh, plus 110. And uh, that was on Sunday for a 4 unit winner on Sunday. On Saturday we had a 4 unit winner on Arizona and uh, Seattle. Over the eight and a half, eleven to two was the final. The Astros won yesterday, something like eleven to two as well. And uh, WNBA, nice three unit winner on Indiana, uh, plus the points yesterday, and uh, they were able to to hang tough and uh, get inside the number there. We have another three unit selection today in the WNBA, a seven unit selection in baseball. We are plus twenty eight ninety five for the second half of the baseball season, plus twenty six ten for the second half of the WNBA season. Five straight winning years in the second half for both these sports. So excited about those two selections today. Soccer, nice winner on USA Canada under this weekend. I think we're on 11 and four soccer run as well. Um, let me make sure about that run. And yeah, so hopefully we'll be able to, to post a good day today. We have another three unit selection in, in soccer today uh, as well. So that's what's on tap. We're excited about this weekend of football. We'll have a seven unit selection, a six unit selection and three, three unit selections. Uh, look out for us at the Circa and the Westgate. We are registered. Uh, we are competing in those two contests. So we can cheer for your boy, I see, uh, in those uh, in those contests. And, um, you know, it would be nice to nice to do well in those contests. By the way, it is a 10-4 and 4 run uh, in plus 1795 uh, in uh, soccer as well. Yeah, all right, let's get to your free play today. Your free play today, I like the under between the Blue Jays and the Yankees today. Interesting game. Um, you know, I like the under 8.5. It's been a while since the total has been this low for either team. Uh, Toronto's won three in a row, including 10 nothing in their last game to the Yankees. The Yankees have now lost three in a row. Toronto, so they really need a, a great start from Garrett Cole here. Uh, Toronto's, Toronto's gone back gone under in back-to-back -back games. The Yankees have gone under in four of five games. Mats went six innings, six hits, and one run against the Yankees last time, but he sort of pitched blah against the Orioles in his last game. Uh, his team ended up winning five to four, but he gave up four walks. And this is the lowest total the Yankees have faced in quite a while, and Cole has given up two runs in 24 innings as well. Uh, you can take a look at the Yankees' run line if you want. That's not a bad play. Um... Let me check something real fast. I might actually switch it. I'd rather give you a, a side than a total, frankly. Um, you guys get to hang out with me as we make a live change here, maybe. Uh, so, yeah. Yeah. So, what's the Yankees' score line lately? 4-4, four, 3-7-0. Four, yeah, getting shut out and Mats with four walk. Got like, yeah, I'm gonna change the play. Uh, we're gonna go with, um, we're gonna go with the Yankees run line. I can't, 
can't give you uh, Yankees money line. That's just the line is too high. But I, I don't mind giving you Yankees run line here as your free play today. Uh, I think you can get them at what? I'll give you the run line line in just a second here. Uh, you can get them at about minus 120. Okay, Yankees run line is your free play today. Now, in addition to that, I also like Philadelphia today. I know Philly beat Milwaukee 12-0 yesterday, which is why it's not a premium or anything. But Philly's five games above 500 now. They beat Milwaukee 12-0 yesterday. Brewers lost 0-12 to with Woodruff on the mound. Uh, Nola went four innings, six hits, and six runs, and two home runs in his last game. He's a great bounce back pitcher, which is why he's favored on the road against Milwaukee here. Remember, he went eight innings and, and two hits against the Padres. He also went seven innings and three hits and no runs against the Brewers last time. I know the Brewers have revenge against him, but Lauer pitched great in his last game, but he did, typically doesn't put back-to-back -back great efforts, and he's gone under four out of his last five games as well. Uh, I'll take Philadelphia and Nola on the bounce back here today as your extra lean. Uh, other than that, uh, we will ride. Uh, yeah, other than that, YouTube Premium. I will see you in just a few minutes. Um, in just a few minutes, and it'll be on the Reds and Cubs in a good selection there. Also, talk to you about Washington or uh, Connecticut and Dallas in the WNBA as well. We'll try to go for four straight YouTube Premium selection winners today as well. Hope you guys are doing well. I'll see you back here tomorrow. If you enjoyed the content, please take a moment to like and subscribe. Twitter, uh, we have a couple extra trends on games that could be useful to you for tonight as well.